This race is like nothing else in the world. What is interesting to me about the Pikes Peak Hill Climb is the variability, and most of that variability is around the weather. Jeff Zwart is, is uh, famous for saying that if you took the number of turns that it takes to get to the top of Pikes Peak and you just flattened them out, it would be one of the most difficult race courses on the planet. Now add some altitude and see what happens. Pikes Peak is one of the hardest races mentally because you only get really one shot at it. One of the things that keeps bringing me back is the personal challenge. When you get to the summit, you have to be happy with knowing you left something on the table, that you didn't go 10 tenths all the way, because if you go 10 tenths all the way, you're not likely gonna make it. You're not used to sitting around all day and then having to go flat out right away. And that, that's not so easy to get used to because there is a lot of waiting before you go, and like nothing is happening with you and your team, absolutely nothing. And then all of a sudden, it's like 30 seconds, you gotta get the wheels on, get, get the tire warmers off, you gotta get the lines. It's like bam, 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 bam. In the race, you're really just thinking about that moment. There's not much extra bandwidth to worry about what's ahead or especially what's behind because you can't do anything about it anyway. You're really just trying to take in what you're facing at that particular time. The effort for us is, it's a 12 month effort. I mean, there's just countless hours that go into the production of one nine minute run up the mountain. just an accomplishment to get to the top. It's taken me a while to realize that, but it's it's really a, it's really something special that you really don't get anywhere else.